to show us thoughts going into uh, the conference tournament, to show us mindsets, and, and just kind of the excitement of heading into the postseason. I guess if y'all want to go one at a time, we'll just go for it. Uh, I mean, uh, my mindset right now is completely different, you know, from, from the, because, you know, our, our goal is to get to the tournament, so I mean, our uh, whole mindset is just shifted to, you know, trying to win every game now. I mean, you know, there's no, there's no room, there's no room for, er uh, for errors, and so we just gonna have to go out there, play hard, as hard as, hard as we can, and then just do anything to get, it, to get the win. Um, you know, one of our first goals was to get that uh, the first in the conference, and we didn't get that. So uh, the second second goal was to get that first round by, so we achieved that. So the next goal is to try to win the tournament, you know, so we can get uh, into the NCAA tournament. Uh, so our mindset is, uh, you know, we're trying to, trying to stay locked in and focused, ready to play. Um, and we know that we're going to have to bring it every game. It's going to be tough every game. Keaton, today, uh, Javon was named to the first team All Conference USA. What what can you say about you know playing with Javon and the kind of season he's had this year? Um, you know, this is one of the best players I've ever played with. You know, uh, since since I was little, you know, growing up. Uh, so he's one of the best players uh, I played with, played against. Uh, you know, so for him to get that achievement as big time, you know, uh, much, much respect for him. And Javon Keaton was named to the second team today. What what can you say about playing with him this season? I mean, you know, he he, he most definitely should have got first team, uh, no doubt. But uh, I mean, the season he's had, it, you know, he grew so much from the from last year, and just to see a guy grow like that, you know, just like my best friend, you know, he he, he, he pushes me so uh, he pushes me, and we push each other to just to get better, you know. And we we both we both want one goal, and it's just to win. So. You know, when we, we come together, you know, we, we just try to push, we just try to push each other as hard as we can, and uh, just just to just to help the team and, and just get the wins. You know, you know, we just trying to get trying to get to a certain level, and uh, you know, we just trying to reach our goals right now. You know, and that's that's get to the tournament. So I mean, you know, we know it's, it's not gonna be it's not gonna be easy. So uh, you know, we just working, and then he's, he's a great player. He, he knows. He, he pushes me harder. I still, still haven't been able to beat him one on one yet. So, uh, <laughs> I mean, it just shows, you know, we we just trying to do anything to win, and you know, we just gonna keep we just gonna keep doing that uh, uh, moving forward. You know, rough shooting night in Southern Miss the other night. Do you think that's something that just happens every once in a while? And it's good to get this out of your system right now. Is now the meaningful games are really. I mean, if if, if, if you watch the game like we, I mean, the shots we were taking were. Open, you know. Uh, I mean, we, it was just—I think it was just one of those nights that nothing, nothing was, nothing was going right for us. Uh, but you know, we just didn't—we tried not letting it get to get to us. Uh, I mean, but Southern Miss had a hell of a game. You know, they—they they weren't missing no shots. Uh, they, they just had one of those nights that they weren't missing. But uh, yeah, it's, it's it's good to take it out, I have it right now, and have it in the tournament. Keep Keaton, for you, uh, getting second team is a huge honor. I know you probably wanted a little more, maybe deserved a little more. Do you feel like Coach was kind of saying that you're going to take this and use it as putting 15 more pounds of muscle on the offseason? Do you use these as kind of motivational tools? Uh, yeah, for sure. Uh, I feel like I was one of the best players in the conference. Uh, you know, so for me to get second team, I mean, I'm, I'm not satisfied. You know, I'm, not, I'm not satisfied, but it is what it is, you know. So I'm going to come back. We're going to see a even better Keaton Wallace next year. You, you, you talked about trying to get that number one seed in the regular season. You guys finished tied for second but because of uh, tiebreakers, you're number four. Do you like where you guys are headed into this tournament, uh, the, the, the teams you're, you're potentially going to face? Um, the team that we play, uh, the team that, uh, that we potentially play in the tournament, we played uh, already. Uh, and those teams we've had good games against, you know, uh, Middle Tennessee, they got us on the road. Uh, UAB, we split. Uh, uh, ODU, we split. So um, we we know the personnel on these teams. So it should be a good game. J Javon, this is your first tournament. You were injured last year during last year's tournament. Are you excited to be able to see what postseason is all about? Yeah, just you know, just excited to be out there with my with my teammates and. Just trying to get as many wins as we can, you know. All we need, we need three, three wins to get to the tournament. You know, that's that's our goal. But we want to take one at a time, and 
we just gotta we just gotta go in we just gotta go in focus and, and locked in. Going into Thursday, uh, you know, playing both teams already. So how do game plans change going, you know, splitting? Uh, I mean, right. I think scouting wise, I think we gotta wait to to that team goes. But uh, you know, I think I think uh, uh I think our, our team right now is better that is we're better than we were when, whenever we played both of those teams. So uh, I think I think. We just gotta, we just gotta come in locked in for the game and and just be in the scout and just play our game really, and then we, we should be good. With me in DFW area, guys, are you excited? This tournament's up in Frisco. Do you have family and stuff getting to come see you guys? Yeah, yeah. my dad lives over there, so he, he should he he should, he he should come. A couple of my friends should come. It's it's, it's exciting for sure. And you got any family coming and getting to watch it? Uh, yeah, majority of my family is from Dallas, especially in North Dallas area. So. Uh, should be a good crowd, a lot of, lot of family, a lot of friends, and a lot of support should be there for us. All right, boys, appreciate it.